Hey guys, Mason here. Back from our trip to the island, everything worked really well, and it's time for some maintenance. So as you can see, my TKC80 tire here has 8,000 K on it, and it's definitely getting down. So we're going to switch that out, and we're going to try the new V-Rubber tire, just so we have a comparison. Some say it's a little bit better, some say it doesn't last quite as long, so we'll just put it to the test and see how it does. It's very hard for me to switch brands because the TKC80 has been so great, but unless you try them, you don't know. So I fully expect that uh, my next tire, I may be back to the TKC80. But we'll give the V-Rubber a solid go and see how it is. No complaints with the TKC. It's been a great tire, um, and it lasted about twice as long as anyone said it would. So I really don't have a problem with it at all. It's been fantastic. But anyway... Poor old bikes do for an oil change. Check the air filter, uh, adjust the chain, clean the chain, it's a mess. Get it all lubed back up. And uh, we're gonna start by giving it a bath. So let's get on with maintenance day. So there's the drain plug, just pulled out, it's the magnetic one and you can see there's a fair bit of fines stuck to the end of that, clean piece here, so the magnetic drain plug is a good idea, it does collect those fine filings stop it from moving around inside the motor. Um, I got this from Eagle Mike and it's the low profile too. So you get a shorter you get a shorter head which stops some things from catching and hitting it and <clears throat> doing damage. But if you have a skid plate that uh, pretty much protects the whole thing anyway. However to have it for that little magnetic end is worthwhile I believe. And that's what it's supposed to look like. It also comes with new crush washers too. Alright, back to the oil change. Oil filter looks good. Nothing too extreme stuck in it. Yeah, that was a good cycle. I would say she's running pretty clean in there now. Sixty nine inch pounds. Perfect. That'll rise a little bit more too as it settles down out of the motor. Spot on. All right, oil change complete. Now it's tire time. Hey 
Hey guys, if you liked that video, hit the thumbs up button for us. It goes a long way towards helping out the channel. And if you're new here, hit that subscribe button in the upper corner for new videos every Sunday. Be glad to have you along for the ride.